Good morning, guys. Yep, that is a bird right behind my head. Good morning, I'm up and I just finished feeding our crow. And Gabby and I are just sitting here and it's Friday and um, Gabby and I have a question for you guys. We are trying to figure out a name for this guy. He is so amazing. And we don't have a name. Charlie. Gabby wants Charlie, but I'm not- Because it could be used for a girl or a boy. Yeah, but I'm not sold on Charlie and he could be a boy or a girl. And don't poop on that blanket because I'll be mad. Anyway, he just pooped on my hand, to tell you the truth. But anyway, we are loving the crow. Last night, I had to give him a bath because he was so covered in food, and I was worried about him not being able to breathe and stuff because his face was all a mess. Don't touch him <laughs> off the couch. Yeah, don't let him, don't touch him for a minute. Don't touch him. Gabby. There we go. Thanks. Better. Anyway, so oh God. I had to give him a bath. It had to be done, so I gave him a bath, and it terrified him to the point that when I took him out of the water, it was only a few seconds, but when I took him out of the water, he was like, oh, mama and he decided he loves me so now i can hold him i can cuddle him in a blanket when i feed him can i do that yeah when i feed him he just acts like a normal bird now he's not terrified of me anymore it's called imprinting when a bird decides that you're its family it oh, imprints on you head. yeah you can see his head anyway there's gonna be lots of fun footage with this bird because crows don't jump off. if you guys don't know crows are fun literally the most fun i'm sure you guys are all gonna have horror stories for me about crows but they're literally so much fun like he'll be big enough that he'll be able to run around on the floor with the dogs and like sam said there'll be pee poop everywhere probably but i'm pretty good at cleaning up after him so did you see what he just did with his feathers what did he just do with his feathers like he like puffed them all out. Oh, he's pretty. I know. Do you guys think he's pretty? Why name him Charlie? It's or hard to lit. get him because he's sitting in the, he's so backlit. I love him. I love him. Do you love him? What? Yeah. We have been busy all morning, you guys. It has been the craziest day of our first day of summer vacation. I can hardly wait for Sam to get home because it's always fun for me when he's here. Anyway, I am a genius. Okay, I'm not a genius, somebody else is a genius, and I copied them, and that in itself is being a genius. So I have this thing called our summer rules. So basically, these are all the things my kids have to do before they can have any screen time or any electronics. So they have to make their bed, brush their teeth, brush their hair, make sure they're dressed, have breakfast, plus they have to do 30 minutes of reading and of coloring. They have to clean up a room, we have to play outside, and they have to build something, and they have to help someone in the family. Isn't that genius? My kids were super busy all the way till lunch. It was amazing. Gabby is hoping to make butter slime. Is that what it's called? She's got all of her sugar slime. She's got all of her stuff. We don't have sugar, so we have to go get that. But look at this. Here they are in here. I put them in this vase, and I put them on this little thing, and I made it like a flowery fruit holder. Isn't that beautiful? Flower fruit holder? Yeah, I love it. I took a picture of it and put it on Instagram because I thought it was super pretty. Yeah, I did. And you know what else I did? I uh, took a picture of Gabby holding our new, or holding our bird because he's awesome now. He's awesome. He's been hanging out. I've been letting him run around free and he's been hanging out in the window over there. And literally there was a fly flying by him and he stabbed it with his beak and then ate it. Isn't that amazing? We're talking about you, dude. Yes, we are. We found, we bought two new slides. I'll get the other one. Okay, let's show them that. Oh. Oh yeah, over my. Oh. Yeah. So, you know, we're getting ready for a yard sale Where's of stuff bread? everywhere, you guys. All over my house is covered in Where's stuff the, for the yard sale. Why is the bird out? Because I'm going to get him out. If he just stopped pooping, it would be much better. Anyway, um, so I've been bringing stuff out of the attic, cleaning it all up, and look what I found. She found this one first. It's like they got a new Tinker present Stallion. today. Tinker Stallion. And then I found this guy. He blends yep. right in with our farm. Yeah, so when Gabby was a little girl, just a sec. When Gabby was a little girl, she loved pintos or paints, whatever you call them, and she got this. Her aunt bought her that one. It was one of the very first likes she ever had. Is that the very yeah, first one? Just wait, fun. look. Look, you guys, whoa. Look. Can I show them something? He's got a girl? dirty face, but isn't it cute? Show them Watch. All right, pray, guys. He's doing so much better. Wait. Uh -oh. Mom, they haven't seen mine yet. Oh, yeah, you showed it, oh. I thought. Ta-da! 
Isn't that amazing? Now hold his leg. Hold his. Remember, I told you you got to hold his feet with one hand. Okay. Okay. Show your schleich. Beautiful. What kind do you have? Um. I. All right. They'll tell us because they are super smart. What kind is this guy? Oh, so Gabby said it's a. Uh, shoot. She told us what it was. There. I did it. No. Okay. Hold on to him there. So there. It's. There we go, girl with a bird. Ooh. Whoa, careful. Careful, okay. careful. Careful, careful. Careful, careful. Oh my gosh. Giving me a heart attack. Anyway, a uh, bunch of you guys have been yes. chatting me up on Instagram and I just want you guys to know that, I think I said it before, but it's me that comments on our YouTube channel for the most part and it's me that comments on all of our social media, not Sam, so when you're talking to anybody on there, it's always me. I named him Chai. Chai? Chai. Chai. He is beautiful. Yeah, this is scratched paint. Where did I get him? Uh, Aunt Dom bought him for you, believe it or not. No, you not guys? that one. Yeah, when they were really little. Yeah, I'm sure of it. Anyway, um, yeah. also we forgot to tell them guys, do you guys know, did we tell you guys that the girls are going to summer camp? This summer, they are headed back to the barn every single day for the entire day for a whole week again, right? And we were thinking that maybe we, whoa, we were thinking maybe we'd put them in for two weeks. We signed them up right away for one week. And then because we were afraid that we get booked up. And then we were just thinking the other day, you know, maybe we'll put them in for two weeks because imagine two whole weeks this summer, Sam and I could be laying on the beach every day and just enjoying our life. And yeah, they are booked. So we can only get them in for one week, but that's okay. But anyway, yeah, our bird is doing awesome. He's getting so much better. Look at how pretty he is. He's got a dirty face. Here he, here he is. He's just starting to learn to fly. Listen, dude, stop trying to fly away from me. Anyway, look at, I have a parrot on my shoulder. No, a, a crow on my shoulder almost my shoulder did i already ask you guys to tell us name ideas for him because he still doesn't have a name and the poor guy needs a name anyway last night sam said you know i think we should teach him to say i'm gonna get you i'm gonna get you because you can you imagine if you're walking down the sidewalk and this bird just popped out of nowhere and started saying i'm gonna get you <laughs> wouldn't that be scary but it would be so funny too we are at Walmart, just Sam and I. Girl stayed home with Nick, and you will not believe it. I literally broke two pairs of flip-flops in two days. I just was walking inside, and I just snapped the tongue off, that part off. So here I am, I gotta get some flip-flops, otherwise I will not be walking anywhere in the summer. I really like these thick ones. But, of course, they don't have them in my size, because who would have them in my size? Why would they ever be in my size, right? I lied, I found a pair. I'm just gonna try them on. They're comfy. Wow, they're so comfy. I uh, spent the whole afternoon out here cleaning up the pool. I vacuumed the bottom and it's perfect now. Just joking. Totally green still. Seventy degrees. That's what happens in Canada though. To keep a pool clean and fresh you have to swim in it all the time to get all the stuff from the bottom to come up to the top so that it can be sucked in the filter Ooh, pretty bright but because it's so cold here all the time you can only swim like once or twice a week until the thick of the summer and then we only have about maybe five weeks of really good swimming time so yeah anyway it's a work in progress right why did you get that? i think that fit me because yeah I like... we and i pretty much wear the same kind of shoe size shoes now almost do you like them? Really comfy. They feel comfy. Yeah. That's, that's what I like. I just don't like the yeah. colors. Of I don't really the like the red either. But No, I don't like the styles, but I like this part and I like that it kind of When you get to my age? Yeah. When you get to my age, it's comfort over beauty. Yep, we're home and I'm going to check on this pool. I notice it's kind of leaning. <laughs> Do you notice that? Look at that. That pole is kind of leaning. I wonder if the other side is. Anyways, we're out by the pool and I just realized something. 
Yes, we need to put algaecide in the pool. Could I actually Laura touch spent water? all afternoon um, skimming the bottom of the pool, but because we don't have a sand filter, can't really get the sand out. Not all of it anyways. Look how green it is. Well, it's green. See how green it is? So green. Look at the walls of the pool, how green it is. Now watch this. See how green it is? You really need somebody to swim in this thing. Because now look at the wall. I can. It's getting blue. So okay. what I'm going to do right now okay. is I got this broom. I'm going to sweep the sides. Anyways, I sweep the sides of the pool. It looks a little bit better. Anyways, I'm going back to the store, get some algae side. And tomorrow, put some more chlorine in. So the girls didn't come with us to Walmart before because they want to stay home and now they're forcing me to buy them flip-flops. Yes, I need more. You guys are applying flip-flops now. Flip you, I need new flip-flops. I'm stuck in the shoe department getting flip-flops when we should be buying chlorine and algaecide. There we go. Algaecide. How much do I need? Add 200 milliliters per 10,000 liters. All right, I'm gonna get this concentrated stuff rather than the big jug. Because why carry a big jug when you can get the concentrate? country stuff. So we'll get the algae side, algae guard or whatever it is. I'm gonna put it in the pool and then chlorinate it again. We should be good to go. When we get a farm we have to have a garden so that we can grow lots and lots of carrots so that we can eat some and the horses can eat some. Good idea. So that we don't have to buy them. And on that note tomorrow we are going to see a farm. There's an open house at an, another farm and we're going to go look at it tomorrow. What are you doing? Laying. Laying? Oh. You're laying around? Yes. Lazy? Now I'm Lazy. sitting. But I can you must be a teenager. You're doing nothing. Guys, I watch as I cancel down the aisle. Okay, watch. Anyways, we're going to end tonight's vlog and we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.